what's good? Coming to you from the Pro Football Hall of Fame in Canton, Ohio. Something that has always been on my bucket list and I thought, man, why not roll it into a family trip? So I got to walk around with my son, show him all the Broncos greats throughout the years. My biggest takeaway is just seeing that uh, this is a team like my entire NFL identity is wrapped up in the Denver Broncos and just seeing uh, that we're a rather young franchise like they have this one interactive timeline that just shows man the the Chicago Bears and the Arizona Cardinals go back to the 1920s and there was 40 years of NFL history um, so I feel like all in all I was very impressed with how well represented the Denver Broncos were I think I kind of came in here feeling like the rest of the league sleeps on us but man when you got 40 years of history that we weren't even a team when you consider that we're starting to slowly trickle in and seeing some of our greats in there it was awesome to introduce my son to Terrell Davis, to Steve Atwater, to Champ Bailey. To He knew Peyton Manning, but he never got to see him win. And so showing him, uh, letting him see those Super Bowl rings was incredible. And, and then to really talk about like who are the next Denver Broncos who we're gonna be seeing enshrined here in Canton. Without a doubt, we know Von Miller will be a first ballot Hall of Famer having helped us win and become Cam Newton's daddy, obviously. Uh, but then seeing him also get a ring with the, the Rams as well. So I know Von Miller is gonna go in, but as I think about like who are the next Denver Broncos currently on this team who's gonna be in Canton, it's hard to not see Pat Sertan end up there. Like his trajectory is definitely pointing towards Pat Sertan being enshrined in Canton one day. Uh, I, you know, I also have hopes for Bo Nix. It's cool to see they have a display with all of the draft cards for the quarterbacks and incredible to see his front and center in the glass there, uh, which you can see on the screen. And I think he's gonna be one of those players who goes from just being that little draft card to being uh, a, a bust that we walk by and see, remembering the Auburn and Oregon great. And it was cool to school my son in Madden at Canton. Uh, but yeah, well, we'll bring him on here and see what he had to think. We are here today at the, where are we? We're at the Pro Football Hall of Fame, as you can see. We are at the Pro Football Hall of Fame, and we are seeing Broncos all over the place. Whose bust was the coolest one you saw? Like that, your favorite, the statues. Who was your favorite one you saw today? Um, probably uh, Coach Prime. Yeah, we saw Coach Prime. We saw Peyton Manning. We saw Randy Gratisher's spot where he's going, the newest Denver Bronco who's going in there, number 53, Randy Gratisher. We saw the man who started the whole Mile High Salute. Do you remember his name? No. Terrell Davis was his name. Big question for you, Jay. Who is the next Denver Bronco whose face is going to be in there? We talked about him. Number 58. Um, Von Miller. Von Miller. As soon as he's done, everyone's saying Von Miller is a first ballot Hall of Famer, and I believe in that. Uh, yeah, otherwise, it was cool walking around, seeing a bunch of people see us rocking our Bronco stuff, and... A lot of people saying Bo Nix is the fix. Uh, what do you think? What are your thoughts on Bo? Um, I think he's not going to doubt us like uh, Russell Wilson did. I think he's going to be a great quarterback. Yeah, he's going he's gonna to get the job done when Russell couldn't. Uh, but it was really cool to see a bunch of people asking us like what we thought about Russell Wilson. Uh, we saw a bunch of people wearing Steelers gear. That was a little weird because we're paying for Russell Wilson to play with the Steelers. But... Uh, a lot of people saying go Broncos. We actually got to see three Denver Broncos Super Bowl rings. I uh, got to see our main man Pat Bolin and the side of that Broncos ring saying this one's for Pat. Pretty cool as well. Overall, uh, what do you think? Pro Football Hall of Fame, would you recommend it to Broncos fans to come here? Yeah, I would uh, really recommend it. So kids, adults alike, man, that was awesome. Um, i have been waiting to come here for a long time. It was always on my bucket list and awesome to see. Uh, really, we got Broncos training camp just around the corner and there's a ton of positional battles to be keeping your eye on. Uh, the one I'm looking forward to watching is the cornerback battle to play out. We know we got the best cornerback in football, Pat Sertan, and who's going to be playing behind him. Is it Riley Moss? Uh, really, who's going to win that positional battle, that uh, cornerback number two? Watching the running backs is going to be cool too. Uh, anything else to say to the peeps? Um, one thing I want to say is go Denver Broncos. I believe. Do you believe? Yeah. Well, then you look at that and say, believe, baby. 
Bowie, baby. Let's do it on the count of three. One, two, three. Bowie, baby. Bowie, baby.